Today we are going to be going over how to do the auger sensor calibration on your Hallmaster grain cart. You're going to start by opening up your app, turning on your hydraulics, keeping in mind that your hydraulics could be going in either direction. Once you're in the app, go to settings, calibration, angle sensor calibration. At the top right of your page, you're gonna hit the red disable button. Confirm turning off your disable controls. Keep in mind now that you're disabling your auto controls, you will have the capability of moving the spout while it is in transport position. So be careful as you're moving through your calibration sequence. Disable. Go to your first angle sensor, which would be your fold sensor. Tap fold sensor. The warning will come up, hit OK. It'll give you folding instructions. Hit OK. Now it's time to calibrate. So you can unfold your auger by holding in your unfold button. As you're holding in your unfold button, you will see that the unfold icon will light up green, indicating that you are unfolding. Once you're all the way unfolded, you can hit the set button that is beside your unfold icon. Set. Now you can fold in. Once you're folded all the way in, you can hit set and calibrate. Calibration successful. Hit next. And now you can move to your next one, which will be your spout Z. Again, it'll give you a warning, give you instructions, hit OK. At this point, you'll have to unfold your auger again. Once your auger is unfolded, you can pivot your spout all the way in one direction. So that was clockwise, and you can see on your screen that the clockwise max was indicated. Once you're all the way to your clockwise direction, rotate back just a touch, hit set. Now you can go all the way counterclockwise. Once you've hit the end, back just a little bit, hit set, and then bring that spout back to its center location. Once it's at its center location, you can hit set on your storage and then calibrate. Successful, hit next. Next we'll do our pivot sensor. Again, go through your warnings and your instructions. So now you can pivot all the way down. Hit set. And pivot all the way up. Once pivoted all the way up, you'll hit set again and calibrate. Last one will be your gate sensor. Going through your warnings and your instructions. So now our gate is all the way closed, so we can hit our close set button and we will open our gate all the way and hit our open set button. Now that we've set both of those, we will hit calibrate, and that is done. Now that all of our sensors are green, we can hit complete calibration. Again, showing you that all the sensors are green. Tap complete calibration one more time. Now it'll ask you to enable auto controls. Hit enable, and this will complete the calibration sequence for your angle sensors.